sorrow replete with calm. And you will know once in your life that pain is the sublime sanctuary of the soul. I would like to empty the flower of my sorrow in your soul and give myself to you completely. William? Here. What are you doing? The sun is rising. Mm. The rays are sliding through the window. It's beautiful. Come look. Isn't it beautiful? You are beautiful. This is the most special time of day. It's a birth. I'm glad you joined me here. I love Cuba. It's so much better than New York City. Ugh, it was cold, flat, and gray. I can't believe people live there. <laughs> it's like one big concrete impersonal jail. You but... did very well for yourself in New York. We were there only for six months, and you made your mark. Julia de Burgos, poet. La Prensa interviewed you. I can't believe how quickly success happened for you. And that group of writers, they gave you tribute. Which you didn't go to. <laughs> I have to work. Somebody has to support the big shot poet from Puerto Rico. Like you said, I didn't need your help. I did well for myself. But Cuba is different. First of all, it's so warm. I'm so inspired here. My mind can stop thinking and creating. The poetry is just flowing. You seem to be writing a lot. There's so many things to do in Cuba. When you go to a poetry reading, the place is overflowing with people. But you wouldn't know that because you haven't been coming to my poetry readings here either. I can't believe you. You better start coming or... Or what? or I'm going to beat you up. Oh, yeah. I'm so scared. <laughs> yeah. I love you. I love you too. This is the right place for us. The people I've met at La Universidad de La Habana are very progressive. You know my professor got me a job writing articles for the newspaper Oriente? I start next week. And I'm so happy in my classes with science and literature and Latin. Latin. Another language. That makes them 10 or 15 languages, right? Oh, don't be funny. Just Latin, Greek, and French. This way I could read Aristotle and Dante in its original language. Once I learn Greek, I hear it's easy to learn Russian. I also want to study German. This way I can read Kant or Zweig. When and are you going to have time for me? Oh, don't be such a baby. I can whisper loving things to you in Latin. Est homo. Well, stop, stop, stop. I was just playing. I don't like to play like that. Sorry. Where are you going? I have to do some things. What's the matter with you? We were having such a good time. All you have done, all morning, is talk about you. I feel like I'm living in Cuba by myself. That's not my fault. You don't want to do anything with me. You don't want to do anything that I want to do. What do you want to do, huh? You're not even going to political meetings with me. You're a socialist and not doing anything about it. Juan, there's another war in the world. There's a lot to be done. I'm aware of that. Well? Oh yeah, I don't want to fight with you. I don't want to fight either. Good. We'll talk about it when I get back. No! I want to talk about it now. Oh yeah, I have to take care of something. I'll go with you. No! No. You stay. No, you just said we don't do anything together. Uh, maybe we can get something to eat. Oh yeah, no! Juan! Can you get dressed? You know I love you. I love you too. Juan? <laughs> Hi. How are you? 
I'm fine. What's new? <laughs> Not much. I'm Julia de Burgos. Hello. She's a friend of mine that I met at the university. What? <laughs> Great. What, what are you studying? It's good to see you. We have to go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> Let's get together sometime. Sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hasta luego. Goodbye. Goodbye, Juan's friend. Would you stop it? You are very rude. You didn't even introduce me to your friend. I knew you were still a fight. A friend. <laughs> a friend. A friend. I'm a friend you met at the university. You've never even been to the university. Julia, forget about it. How dare you? You don't understand. Understand? You just told that friend of yours, whoever he is, that I was your friend. You just denied that I exist in your life. What is there to understand about that? He knows my family. So? Juan, why shouldn't your family know we're together? Juan! I told them we were not together anymore. I can't believe this is happening to me. I left Puerto Rico, and then I went to New York City with you, and now Cuba... I have to, to Julia. Me. I have no choice. They made me... Don't touch me! They said they would cut off my money. So let them cut you off. You make enough money at the pharmaceutical company. It's not the same thing. And my family is very difficult. I don't want to hear anything about your family. You're not the man I thought you were. You don't even love me, do you? Julia, I love you. No, you don't. At least be a man and say what you feel. I do love you. Say it. I'm not good enough for your family. Say it. You're making this worse. Say it, Julia. You're not good enough for my family. You're not good enough for me. I'm not like my family. Were you ever going to tell them we're practically man and wife? Oh, she's not good enough. God, you fight like a man. You don't shut You're such a hypocrite. You make it a scene. Oh, she's too poor. A poor Puerto Rican girl from the mountains. What kind of socialist are you? Let yeah. me tell you, a champagne socialist. Shut up. When it comes to living your philosophy, socialism goes out the window. Well, yeah, yeah. Don't you dare tell me, yeah. Get away from me. Get away. I, a fatalist. I, inside myself, always searching for something that my mind can't define. I, multiple, as in a contradiction. I, universal, drinking life in each shooting star, in each sterile screen, in each sediment without borders, and all for what? To go on being the same? <laughs>